Hello, I'm Artifacts Mars. This is just a quickie. Uh, the Reverend Billy Graham, who is 99 and has been suffering from a variety of different health issues, has passed away. Uh, I don't care what you say about his religion. This guy was the real deal. He wasn't one of these uh, fake TV preachers that sit there and tell you uh, the more uh, money you uh, pay them, the higher you will be in uh, the kingdom of heaven or something. He, was, he wasn't one of those. He was the real deal. World's best known evangelist, Reverend Billy Graham, has died. He was 99 from the gangly 16-year-old baseball-loving teen upon Christ the Tent Revival. Graham went on to become an international media darling, a preacher to a dozen presidents, and the voice of solace in times of national heartbreak. He was America's pastor. Graham retired to his mountain home at Montreal, North Carolina, not Canada. Montreat. Not not Montreal, sorry. In 2005, after nearly six decades on the road calling people to Christ at 417 all-out preaching and music events from Miami to Moscow. I don't know what that means, 417 all-out preaching. I have no idea. Its final New York City crusade in 2005 was sponsored by 1,400 regional churches from 82 denominations. Billy Graham grew up in what would be most would consider humble, ordinary beginnings, but because he yielded himself to God, he was used to accomplish an extraordinary, forever impacting the lives of countless people, said Family Research Council President Tony Perkins. Well... I hope you are where you thought you were headed. As an agnostic, I've kind of seen the other side, and I'm not sure there's a heaven per se. But, uh, as an agnostic, I certainly recognize what this guy did, and he was a real guy. Nothing fake about him. He is the best. So, good luck with Eternity, Reverend Graham. I'm Artifacts of Mars.